Good morning everyone! <laughs> I'm in Dresden at the Transperm factory, Volkswagen. Volkswagen invited me today because they're doing a shooting with the ID3 and the ID4, so photo shooting, and they uh, uh, asked me to come along and then I can drive an hour in this. <laughs> and of course, I don't want to miss that, so I drove four and a half hours here. <laughs> so the normal Max is here with the 20 inch tires, head up display, IQ light and everything in white. Looks amazing. And what's great is here is a first. So this is not plus or max, this is first. How do I know it? First of all, it's a uh, it's 18 inch wheels and it's normal LED light. It doesn't have the IQ light, you can see that here. And you can see the seats, it's different seats. Hope you can see that. <coughs> Still amazing looking car. God, I love white. White is my color. But what a nice sight. I, two ID, ID3s, I would say ID4, two ID3s in one spot. And an e-golf and an e-up. Look at that, I found another one. This is now a plus. 19 inch wheels, no head-up display, but IQ light. So this is my car. <laughs> oh, we have to look if the, in the interior. Is it my, my steering wheel? No, it's a dark steering wheel. This is not mine. <laughs> but still, looks awesome. Look at this beautiful car. Look at that. He's coming. ID4. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> he can't get in. Oh, he can't get in. Nice color. Ooh. Oh. Look at that. <coughs> yeah, it looks amazing. Look at that. <laughs> Security. It's too bright. How cool is that? This is so cool. Yes, right. So, we're here, we're in Dresden at the Semper Oper and we're doing a little photo shoot and I'm getting photographed while I do, <laughs> do this. And look at the ID4, beautiful. And totally camouflaged. I can lay lower. Oh man, look at this. Awesome. Yeah, it steals the show of the ID3. <laughs> Only ID4. Oh, you're cool. Beautiful, beautiful car. Look at that. And what a nice location. Look at it. It is one nice location. Those are some big fat tires. What is it? 21 inch? Yes. Oh, let's do it like this. Oh, you can see. Weird lights here. That looks nice. And look at the door handles. They're in flat. It looks like. So, what is this? Why is here a thing here? I look at the lights. And I can't show you the inside. Not allowed to, just outside. Inside is not finished, therefore can't show you. I look down, but I can show you the same here protection on the thing. Let's drive. Oh, yes. Go drive. Isn't this the first video of an ID4 driving?
Now they're meeting up. 93, 94. They fit great together. Nice atmosphere with the construction site. <laughs> Everybody's taking pictures. Well, oh, you can see how far the wheels go in. Look at that. Wow. This is a Max, by the way. And this is the one, the car I can drive. It has almost the newest software. They said 3.91. In the newest software, when the, when the uh, customers are getting the car, will be 3.92. <laughs> I'm being followed. Look at this beautiful car. You all seen it. Look, my camera equipment in there. I just drove in there. How amazing is that? Ooh, ooh, piano black. But no piano black in here. They changed it. Fingerprints. And in the middle. Yeah, that's okay. Uh-huh. Home charger. Mm-hmm. Look, there it is. Oh. 10 amps, 2.3 kilowatt. Ooh, some safety stuff. Yeah, why does everybody complain about this? I find it totally fine. So much space. Look at that. Ooh, I didn't see that. There's a, a thing down here too. Ooh, this doesn't look like it's gonna hold too long. Awesome. Oh, look at that. How far you can put the wheels to the side. Look at that. Just, it looks freaky. Let's get a bit closer, huh? Should we? Look at that when you see it here. This is a nice look. Look what I found. There's a camera in the front. How cool is that? Huh. And here too, look. So a 360 degree camera and here's the protection for the logo on the floor. So another camera here, of course, and they are the protection. Cool. Next photo shoot. This is the Dresden Frauenkirche. Very famous spot. We're taking pictures here. Just took very nice pictures. Look at the beautiful cars. Ah, oh, great day. <laughs> Who's excited? This is nice. So would you believe me if I tell you that I have a great day? <laughs> uh, we'll now drive this car here. This I'm not allowed, but this I will drive now, soon. Need a light. Yes. Cooling the battery, all works. I just drove this beautiful car. Even with the 20 inch wheels, it's an amazingly comfortable ride. And I was going over big cobblestone. It was just amazing. So comfortable, they're so quiet. The E sound is totally fine, no problem. The blinker sound uh, is, is fine. Um, <clears throat> what I can say is that uh, you can put it in drive when your seatbelt is not on. So I was totally wrong when they told me that. <laughs> it's not true. Um, and it remembers B. So the first time when you get in the car and you put it in drive, it is in drive and then you have to press again for B. But when you are driving and you are in B and then have to reverse or something without going out of the car, then it remembers that you are in B when you go forward. So it remembers the state. Great, the same as with the Renault Zoe. Oh my God. So I just had to do some driving around so they could take pictures. And I scratched the car here on this thing here. Look at that. I made a scratch. Can you see it? Here. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm horrible. <laughs> oh. Scratch the car. 
And with the ID4, of course, I wasn't allowed to drive. It's a prototype, so I need a prototype license. And I wasn't allowed to drive in the car or take pictures or film anything from inside the car. It was always under a blanket, so you couldn't see what is happening and how it looks like. Outside the car looks really great. It's not that much bigger than the, the, the ID3. The wheelbase is the same. It had 21 inch, in, inch wheels. Of course, then the, the, the top of it is, is massive because it's an SUV, so it's all higher and it, uh, it's heavier. Uh, it looked really good. I mean, with the camouflage, uh, the, the, the yellow blue thing, it was, of course, <laughs> people were recognizing, what is this? What's going on? It was, it was a lot of fun to drive around. We drove to a few locations and uh, again it was was a lot of fun to see the car and take a lot of pictures um, what was extremely funny was uh, right at the time where, where uh, we switched drivers in the ID3 so I could drive the ID4 was stopped by the police <laughs> they were uh, not so happy with the uh, stickers on the back window to said oh, that looks weird 30% of the back window has to be free so uh, you can you need to see through and the driver told them um, I'm pretty sure Volkswagen would not give me a car to drive around if this is not uh, according to the law and then they were like talking a bit and then they let him go but uh, it was just funny uh, uh, to see that and, and it really happened it was funny the newspapers were there and took a few pictures and everything uh, it was the whole day we started at I don't know we had the meeting at 9 and then we started at 10, I think, and then we were done at 7. So I came home late. It was the four and a half hour drive from here to uh, Dresden and then back again to four, four and a half hours in my stupid ice car. And I hate it so much, <laughs> but it was worth it. It was, it was a great day. It was a lot of fun. And seeing the, the ID4 move and hearing the, the E sound and driving the ID3, it was a lot of fun. So thank you Volkswagen for giving me the opportunity to do that. Um, and my Patreons already know why I was there, what was the meeting about. You will get to know what it's about a bit later. Um, but because Patreons need to, they support me, so I support them with information. That's how it works. Uh, but I think that's it. Thank you much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Bye.